My heart for so long has been leaking at the seams. All these years trapped in a cell, only able to imagine my dreams. So there I remain, a little boy, thinking about the life that awaits. As time ticks by, I cry out my eyes while my body quakes and my hair turns gray. And if you happen to see yourself in my words, like looking in a mirror, let me start off by proclaiming and making something absolutely clear. I may break, but I'm not broken, and neither are any of you out there who struggle and toil with your dreams. Together we can rage these ferocious waves on our journey out to sea. We're not giving in to that thunderous voice that says turn back before it's too late. Instead we'll reach further into Moby's head and find another voice to take its place. One that's not familiar might not have the same power and weight to be heard among the crowd, but with patience, awareness, intention, and faith, this voice will build and gain strength with an empowered and purposeful sound. Then every time we feel that tightening our chest, that aches and desperation and pain, longing to be saved and healed, we will close our eyes and listen to that voice inside that we have made so real. And in the dark, we will hear all the others who have been crying out to be set free from their cells, like the sound of an ocean trapped inside the walls of every single and solitary shell. Then we won't feel so alone as we're surrounded by walls made from stone and bars. For inside our soul, we'll know that reaching our dreams will be so much better. We support each other and come together and then those bars will break down to stars and all at once stitch together all our broken hearts.